It's been a year of record property prices, low stock and homeschooling. But how long will it last and what do homeowners have in store for next year? Twenty twenty two will be my fifteenth year selling property in Belrose, Davidson, and French's Forest. So to be fair to say that I've handled sales in all type of market conditions, but none as busy as twenty twenty one. In January this year, I said that 2021 was going to be the busiest year ever, and it was. Property prices rose by 36%. There were 12 sales in excess of $3 million, 10 of which were sold by local agents, not out of area agents. In June, I said that winter was going to be the best time to sell, and it was, with record price climbs during that period. So I want to say congratulations to those homeowners who took advantage. So as we throw up the 2021 stats, you can see that Belrose was the greatest performing suburb with a price rise of 42% over the last 12 months. So where to from here? With 58 properties currently for sale and seven weeks away from Christmas, I'm anticipating we're gonna finish this year on a positive note. Although my notes do suggest that September was the peak of the market, I feel that we're going to see a stabilisation and normality, which is only going to bring a little bit of confidence back to the market. Homeowners wanting to secure a premium result have between now and January 2022 to launch their property for sale. The RBA is already hinting at rate rises in the near future and APRA are looking at the banks and how they assess you when you're buying property. So if selling is an option for you, it's time we start planning your sale now, before the stock levels increase and property prices plateau. I'm Shane Brookman, your local trusted real estate expert.